All right, what is up, you guys? And of course, always welcome back to, of course, the UBL Week Seven versus Root, who is our last opponent and most likely our toughest one, as no matter who of us wins, um, either of us will most likely make playoff. And um, no, I'll be honest here, I'm worried, like a lot, and uh, that's not gonna go away. <laughs> <laughs> but I really have been looking forward with this. I've talked with Root before, and um, he helped me go on a part of a, a bigger league, which I sadly messed up. Uh, but he's just always been really nice to me. So, if anything, you know, check this guy out, as he is just one of the better ones. He's definitely one of the nicest people <laughs> in this community. Uh, so, right, Dracovish. Expected that. And we expected Tokis. <clears throat> Pretty much the, all this looks apart, besides Clay Duel, which I definitely didn't see, and Silvali was kind of up there. Let's see, and then we have that Dragon Steel type that I can't remember. They're all done. Uh, I wonder which Silvali it is. Um, Clay Duel. Clay Duel is really spicy. I have no idea how to deal with that. And Cinderace. Actually, the only Pokemon I got right was uh, Dracovish, Togekiss, and uh, Cinderace. I had rolled on the list, but Clay Duel and um, Silval was absolutely not there. So <laughs> I'll be honest, I'm I'm surprised with this. I don't know how to deal with this. Um, all that well. I do own the speed at least, barring Cinderace. Um, so what I want to do is lead off with. Uh, I do want to lead off with Galventula and see what he wants to do. Ooh, if I make it, that is. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> I mean, uh, Yellison is going to have a rough time. If anything, Yellison is pressured to uh, always check... Uh, I'm just going to lower the volume. Um, always check um, Dracovish and Cinderace to an extent, and that's not going to be a pleasant time. Uh, Draldon has low special defense, so that's kind of good. Let's see, his lead is Sylvain. Yeah, and that's the thing. I'm gonna Volt Switch here. Real hope is and scoffed. He is scarfed. Alright, cool. So that's gonna knock out my uh, Galventula. Cool. Knew I should have been Sash this game. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, cool. So, right barrier, and we go for a Mega Horn. That was a bad stall, wasn't it? Um, at least we know it's Scarfs, so that's good. There were better ways of finding that out, however. <laughs> Damn. I was still, I was like, yeah, if you don't want to scarf myself, I don't have to worry about anything. Of course, of course he was scarfed. Let's see, Titanus, that's Clay Duel. Come on. Ah. Oh. Okay. Okay. Not, not a great start. <laughs> not a great start at all. Let's see, Stealth Rock's cool. Can I at least connect the second one, please? There we go. That's kind of nice. That's not going to annoy me at all. This is... Oh, it's bad. So right, I, I guess he just had to even the odds for the miss. If so, you know, thank you, thank you, Root. I guess then that's actually quite nice. Thanks. Let's have thanks one more time. I haven't made up my mind yet. <laughs> oh no, 
I'm ready. You know, I'm, I'm feeling it. This is just this is a rough patch. There's nothing more to it. Um, now, Dracovicious Pokemon comes in naturally here, um, and uh, you know, if it has Crunch, it has Crunch. That's something I need to watch out for. Um, but Jellicent is always going to be my switch, and I have. Um, Colderberry to take a crunch, and uh, it's so obvious that that's my play. So we'll see what he decides to do. Substitute. Right, cool. So gonna go for Hex here. There's a crunch. And the defense drop is absolutely magnificent. And we didn't break it. How about that? How about that? Okay, cool. So, right, Crunch should be his play, I think. I'm gonna U turn here. I really have no idea what to do. What can he do? Fishish Rend. He could have Ice Fang, I'm sure. I figure we U turn, break it, and. Uh, and then it locks. Um, okay, cool. Send that Cremuse again. If he's really smart, he goes for another substitute. But I think it could go for an Ice Fang. We'll see. Psychic Fangs. Alright. Nice. Um, do I have anything that outspeed here? Can I recover ever? I cannot. Right, because I think it's going to go out for a free substitute anyway. He puts me in a spot. Oh, this was not what I was expecting about Dracovich. This is good prep on his side. And I couldn't be more impressed. Ah, cool. We get some momentum. Because now we force him out. Hmm. <sighs> Thank God. To... I have no idea how to say that name. But they should do a good chunk. Yeah, they're alright. So it's a salt vest. So we're sacking Gillicent here, and uh, I mean, we sack Blade till it works. That's the strat right now, and it's, it's not the most convincing one I got. Because I'm pretty sure we'll lose to Cinderace, and uh, I'll be honest, um, I messed up badly here.
it's okay it's just I I'm I'm leveling like what do I really like what can I even do I'll lose the scuffs in the race no matter what I mean keep Rhyperia alive I guess as long as it matters but we die there Dark Bolt's cool um, So with that in mind, we're gonna go to Jum Jum and knock him out. Because yeah, he has no other play. He has to sack it. Or he has another play and I'm just being dumb. Let's see. My Koi. Silvalli. Is Silvalli water? Or is it ice? I guess it could be ice. Let's see. No, it's Silvalli water for sure. I had no intention of losing this game at all, but you know, we, we're getting there. I'm so surprised the way he dealt with my Jillisons, I'm like still in awe of those decisions. You know, I'm, I'm not mad, I'm just... Huh. I, I'm in between impressed and um, stressed out. I have yet to make up my mind how I really feel. <laughs> Falling shot, cool. If it goes to Dracovish, I'm pretty sure I have to stay in and Draco. And I'm not sure I take a fish's rind. The question is whether or not he want to risk that. Ingrid. Alright, so kiss. That could work. Let's see what he wants to do. Um, shell smashing here and then just try to get one of those biggest fire blasts in the world back at him. Um, kind of want him to go for... You know the obvious, which is nasty plotting. Dazzling gleam. All right, that should do a fair chunk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm, it did just about right. And this should stress him out a bit. But he can absolutely take one hit. Right, connecting that, and... Hey! Cool! It, it's one of those things, like, yeah, crit. That, I, I promise you guys, that mattered, because I'm pretty sure when I did a plus two, that was barely cutting the Fire Blast Killer. And that was the offensive one, so that crit matters. But I'm gonna be okay with it, because I need it. <laughs> ah, shit, cool. Um... It's gonna, like I have a match here that I'm absolutely gonna lose. It's all about how I minimize these um, uh, these differentials because it's not looking all right. Death in the race and uh, Powerball doesn't take me out. Actually, I think it does. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it a while here. Because Powerball should be in range, U-turn should be resisted. And I shouldn't be faster since we know it's scarfed. 
So I'm shell smashing. I'll see. High jump kick. Right call. So he's locked into that. And I had no switch ins for that anyway, right? So it doesn't matter. So sending in this destroyer, he knows he needs to survive, so Sil Valley's the Pokemon that's gonna come in, so we're sending in Skulls. Because I need a period for the end game. Sail Valley, Sail Valley, Sail Valley. Hey, buddy. Oh, that's not what I wanted. That's absolutely not what I wanted. Oh, this is way worse. Yeah, alright. Let's start playing that. Alright, that was not what I wanted. I thought Earthquake was free, but also you look like a big risk, so I'm, I'm kind of surprised by this play. Oh, <laughs> take him out? No! <laughs> alright. Anyway, you know, for what it's worth, like, my opponent clearly need or deserves to win this game for all the right reasons. This is, you know, he is way above me this game. And it's okay. It's rough, but it's okay. I really wish it was send mode right now, but nope. Guerrilla Tactics. I mean, U-turn does kill. But that just means that Rakovich comes back in. <sighs> so, right, it, does play, it doesn't play for differentials. Yeah, I guess that's kind of nice. Now it's whether or not he wants to make Cinderace his MVP or not. Oh, had I gone for Earthquake, this would have been a safer match for me. Oh, it's so dumb. Like, should have played that safe. But at the same time, I needed, like, a real offensive momentum. And we just have different ideas of what that offensive momentum was. And my opponent deserved this game so much. I, was, I wasn't worried about this game either, because I had Yellicent. And then you see Substitutes, and I was like, dude, you got me. You got me good. Oh, flinch. Oh, yeah. We have those tactics, too. You know, it's not over. You need three more flinches. And that, that should be that should be about right. <laughs> so that, that's clearly not happening. But, you know, we, we, we speak about those. Like, that's, that's the strat we have. Flinch, flinch, flinch. Pussy. <laughs> All right, cool. Um... I'll be honest, I'm, I'm a bit disappointed with myself. Because I thought... I had a grand vision. Of how I wanted to wrap up this game, and this was not it. And I don't know how that's gonna affect me for playoff, but... If I get knocked out of the playoff because of this, I'll say it's fair. Now I'm gonna show my tech. Because he's gonna go for a surf, thinking he got me. And I'm pretty sure he doesn't. I think I should live this. Salt Vest, Max Special Defense, Stab Surf, like a boss. Like a boss! So it's a 2 0 at least. You know, I'll, it, this is a manly KO. The manliest we got. <laughs> oh, you know, I'm. If this is like the wrap of the season, I just really want to say to you guys, you know, thank you for so much for joining. You guys have been an absolute blast, and uh, yes, we had a tough at times and we had a team that maybe wasn't full in our alley, but I think we did alright. We're leaving this league with a 5-3 record, and I do believe with a zero differential. So, I'll, you know, for being a hyper-offensive player, missed the high jump kick for fucks, no, no, of course not. Um, <laughs> so for being a hyper-offensive player as a player with a team that is absolutely slower than I'm used to, I think I did alright. And to my opponent here, absolutely magnificent game. It was really cool. That sub tech with, um, yeah, you know, I'll take it. 
he got me like a fiddle and that was incredible here i was going on about you know i got i got cover of dracovish but no he got cover on the jellicent and uh, i respect him more for it uh, so that's it guys you know of course thank you for watching you know i probably fill out this video with how the playoffs will go whether or not we make it or not but like i said if we go out like this it's okay I think it's plays like this that makes you really, really understand which people that deserves to be in playoffs. And that is guys like him. So I really hope Ruth make it. But if it doesn't, it's tough. I'm going to blow her out. <laughs> but anyways, as always, thank you for watching and have a great day, everyone. Bye.